Hi everyone, my name is August and I am part of the Dream Yggdrasil team. Um, I'm currently in Sweden and as you can see it's quite a mess because I'm packing and uh, I'm leaving to, to Cape Town tomorrow to meet Nix and all the other people on the team. I am so excited to finally get started on this project in South Africa, in the sun, in the heat and there are a thousand very important people that we have to meet there's a lot of a lot of things to be done so yeah i'm just gonna jump on the plane and uh, i'll see you on the other side <laughs> Yes, you are correct. You will compose another song tomorrow. When you get up, when you wash your face. Finally I landed in Cape Town <laughs> with my best friend Emil. <laughs> yesterday, you will be composing another song. Our sound is completely empty. Left side we have the living, on the right side we, we have the dead. In the middle. We can be between. Oh, look at them! Woo! Yeah! <laughs> okay, we just rolled in to our home in Citrusa. Yay! Wow! This is August room. Yes. So workshop now, but it won't be in a few hours. Hello! The stoop! Tessa! Tessa, come here! Yeah! <laughs> so, we were thinking we wanted to give you a little bit of an update um, on where we are in the project right now. And, um, as some of you know, we, we applied for funding um, this summer and, and this fall. Uh, we applied with three different organizations in Sweden. And we have gotten a no and we got another no. But finally, today, we got a yes. From a... <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was very timely. Um, and it's an organization called the Culture Bridge that decided to give us... Um, a million Swedish kroner. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Wow. But that's not the only news. Um, cause we've got another yes today from Africa Burn, who are backing us, which is super fantastic with a hundred thousand rand with the possibility of another 200,000 rand if they get some some extra funding. So our tree is growing um, and it's really is incredibly enabling for us right now because we're able to enable other people in order to manifest this tree to life. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, and this it's these, so this, exciting. <laughs> it's so exciting. <laughs> it's actually happening. Yeah. <laughs> um so yeah, I mean with this with these funds we're we're really enabled to to start and get going. We can we can really order some materials and, and start some workshop going. Um and um according to the latest budget that we made, this puts us at roughly sixty se or seventy. Sixty or seventy percent funded. So it's it's very good. It's very good, and it's uh it's the energy we need to get the rest of the way. Yeah. Yeah. 
So we're thinking lots of different things that are going to bubble up yeah. and make it happen. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Yes. Love good news. Love good news. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, and now I want to show you something else. If you take a look over here, um, on top of that mountain, right there, right up there, right on the top. I um, I'm speechless. This is incredible. Okay, you have to see what I'm what I'm seeing. So down there, that is where we live. So if you zoom in and zoom in and zoom in, see that? Oh shit! That little house there with the porch. That is where we live. And if we zoom out again, over there you see Citrusdal and the village. And if we zoom out, this is the Citrusdal Valley. And uh, let me see. I'm just climbing around the top of this, climbing around the top of this beacon, of the mountain. So. Continue the panorama. This is where we live, and over here is the rest. Uh, this is the other side of the valley. Actually, next, what is this valley called on the other side? I, I, I don't know it. But past these mountains, that's where the Tanqua Karoo starts, the desert where Africa Burn is located. And then, as we continue around. Over there, past past those mountains over there, you got the Cedarberg. Um, yeah, and then we're back into the Citrusdale Valley. Yes, so I just wanted to show you um, my room and my office. So this is how we set it up now. A little bit of a desk. I got my fabrics. And yeah, that's about it. You don't need much space. You just need to feel at home. And back on the stoop. This is actually the first, the first prototype that we built um, back in May. Hey Tessa. And over here, got the Yggdrasil headquarters. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, look at this. It's going up. Yeah. Super clever, haphazard design. <laughs> yes. And um, we wanted to take this opportunity as well to say thank you. Thank you. Super thank you. Yeah. Hey, this is so exciting. Mm. Yeah. So thank you for everybody, everybody we've spoken to. Thank you for the funding, which is going to make all this dream come alive. Mm. All the conversations, mm. people picking me up from the airport, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> putting us up yeah. all over the world. Yeah. So many people. When and you all think the about people it, people buying yeah. the trees. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> everyone who bought trees. Wow. And it's gonna buy trees. Mm. Wow. Thank uh, you so thank much. Thank you. 